Bishop bishops at Shetima's unveiling exposed what await Christians. Primate Aya Daily, welcome to the news. And please subscribe to our channel to get notified when we post hot juicy news updates. Please click on the notification bell. The leader of the INRI Evangelical Spiritual Church, Primate Elijah Ayodele, has reacted to the controversies of a report of bishops present at the unveiling of Kashim Shetima as the All Progressive Congress APC presidential running mate. Primate Ayodele said the fake bishop at Shetima's unveiling was an indication of what Christians should expect if the All Progressive Congress retains power in 2023. About 30 bishops had attended the official unveiling of Shetima as the running mate of the All Progressive Congress presidential candidate, Bola Tunabu. However, Ayodele said the viral fake bishop that attended Shetima unveiling has shown that the All Progressive Congress wants to kill Christianity and that the presidential candidate of a party does not mean well for Christians in the country. In a statement by his spokesman, the clergyman said they have gone as far as corrupting the Christian system, adding that Christians will be deceived and be silenced if they mistakenly get power. He pointed out that poverty was a tool used to lure the fake bishops to attend the unveiling of the presidential running mate. On the fake bishops that attended the unveiling of a party's presidential running mate, it is clear now that the All Progressive Congress wants to kill Christianity. The presidential candidate does not mean well for Christians, and that is why they have gone as far as corrupting the Christian system. This has shown that a presidential aspirant of a party cannot rule Nigeria. This is how the government will fake us, deny Christians, law Christians to vote for them only to silence them in power. I cannot blame the bishop that we are at the unveiling. The party used poverty as a tool to entice them. And these are the gimmicks they want to use to win the election, showering the country with poverty. Well, at this point, uh, this primates, I know they won't listen to what they talk because, uh, you know, instead of him to come out and give advice, like he suppose, he will come out and say he received the revelation. And the thing that he has never ever received the revelation that is going to help Nigeria out of any of the messes. None. It is only during political. That is why most time when he comes out to speak, I'm not a fan of all these things. I see, I saw, and I did go here, I go did not see. I'm not saying that God does not speak to people, but for him to come out and always use that, ah, uh, no, no, that's a no, no, that's a no, no for me. As Christians, we should not discriminate. Let us not allow religion to divide us. We have been running Christian Muslim ticket for long, yet it has not helped us. We should pray for good leaders. God did not know if you're Christian or Muslim, but how you live your life. Correct? Christians and Muslims should pray for good leaders and forget about if it is Muslim, Muslim, or Christian, Christian. Or she state that many states today are practicing the same religion and corruption is still high. Tenable wife is a pastor. Please, let us not allow religion to further divide us. Now, let me say this. Hmm? Yes, it is good as Christians we should not discriminate, but please don't bring it into this politics. It is very dangerous if you do that. This is not a time to come and be sentimental. This is not a time to come and be eh, because of this. And I have said it several times. Why is it that people are not seeing the real consequences of what I'm saying? Why? The consequences of this is clear. It is way beyond religion. Ah, how I wish people can see it from the angle I'm saying it from. First of all, this person has showed you that he will not be listening to you if, paraventure, he wins that election. Because people gave him what they want. I mean, people gave him the opinion and he decided to quiet down the people. They keep speaking up even as they have done it. He decided to hire a bishop to further quiet down the people. Doesn't this show you something? Can't you do your one plus one? I know that this one plus one is not balancing up. It is not just about religion. It is about the kind of governance that will follow after the post I mean, after pre-election period, after election itself, the post-election era. How is it going to be? They are using poverty as a tool. Yes, I agree with him on some certain places where they say they are using poverty as a tool. And I want to tell you that some things that are going on is caused by these people. Purposely, they purposely do them. 
they will stiffen the economy so that people will be choked so that when they come with whatever gimmicks they are doing whatever they are offering you that time you will feel that it's like a fresh of breast and meanwhile now waiting will kill you and then they give you so yes they are further telling you to oh yeah you know when person they sweat you give them you you open window you come on and i mean you honestly for them you understand when somebody ends ah these are theirs ah sorry we just want on easy meanwhile people waiting inside there's not they complain immediately the person come out you go come out the ac you go further even close the window join so that then go choke then go suffocate do you not see it hmm. go and learn from lebanon it is a kind of non child attitude that gave them out to what christians are suffering there now you don't give a Muslim a chance to control you. That is not giving a chance to control you. And from my from my own point of view, I see it that south just like south and north now. You understand? You don't a north north does not come out to contest. There are some people who are not even supposed to be in this contest. For example, Atiku is not supposed to be in the race. Um Congress is not supposed to be because these people are not us and we have not us sitting there. Now that's not even where I'm going to. If you want to talk about this thing now affecting the post uh, um post-election era i always want you to look at the fact that christians are there to to um check the excesses of their or the other religion as well as muslims there's a variant and there is a policy they're trying to bring out and this is too christian like the muslim that is going to be maybe the vp will say oh please oh this thing you know go work from my angle this thing no pure you know warm at all people are not going to you know it's going to it might even cause you know and uh, it may even cause um, you know the people to you know revolt you understand and the same way if you have a muslim candidate the christian people go say yeah, from this angle where they look out from oh, this thing is not good though make we do and make we balance them i want to believe the vp i mean they are there to check each other's excesses the same thing with the north and south somebody maybe he's from the southern and we want to do something you know because ah no the north they no go you know this thing if you look at from this angle you know go you know go make sense you know let's balance it up the same thing the south the same thing but when by two of them are from the same religion we have somebody who the northerners believe is not muslim enough a southern muslim and we have somebody who's an extremist a northern muslim who is going to be checkmating who hmm Okay. Lea Saibu and others, some killed, some alive in captivity. The Brass Sime killed, no noise as this, and many killings and dozens of crime in the country, no noise as this, but because no money should share, Almighty God will judge everyone according to his works, as he never looks at faces but human mind. Anyone who calls himself a prophet, let him say who wins 2020. <laughs> let him say who wins 2023 election. Well, my brother, you try. Yes, you try. You talk sense. During their show, many people no come as I can't shake body. A whole thing happen. Doing this, nobody come as I shake body, but only during the election. That is what